Is this a practical blooper? <laughs> okay. Makeup. Makeup. Oh, and I need some. I need a little foot space. Okay. All right. Go ahead. Okay. Well, I was in the library. It turns out, Sammy. And uh, you know, the thing is, one of the things I love about me is that uh, there's no Indians like me. There's no Indians like me, and damn it, there's no white people like me. And I enjoy that. I love that about me. I was in the library today, and I was coming out of the restroom, and I was just exactly the same way, except my hair was uh, tremendous. It looked fantastic, as a matter of fact. And so I, I, I came out, I exited the washroom, and I had the key, and as soon as I walked out, the, the librarian sitting behind the desk out in the middle of the floor just, she totally reacted. She was like, and she gave me the stink eye. Her eyes just followed me as I took that key over and placed it on the thing. And I looked over and I made eye contact and I went, hmm. It's kind of uncomfortable. She's just totally staring at me as I crossed the library and she just made an eye contact. And I looked away, I hung the key up, I looked back and she's still looking at me. It's very unsettling. So then I finally give her all, as a joke, I kind of I went like this. And she didn't even look away, she was just like, Whatever you're doing in our library, please do it outside. That's what's going on through my head. Right or wrong, real or imagined, that is what that woman was thinking. So I keep looking, I keep looking, and finally I said, you know what, this is like my experience too. So I walked over and I said, excuse me, when's our date? And she's like, excuse me, and I said, when is our date? Because in polite society, when a man and a woman maintain eye contact long, they're either in love or they can't stand each other. And she was like, excuse me? And I said, excuse me.